I am the mother of dragons. A girl has no name. I mean, when I go to the beach, I'm like a white walker. Since when do we refer to this as food? I just found so much Mucinex. Hey guys, this week on My Drunk Kitchen, we are in mourning. Why do good things have to end? Why are we in a time of mourning? Well, because Game of Thrones is coming to an end. The first episode of the new season starts today. I'm wearing a themed shirt. Do I look like a cool lesbian or like a lesbian that'll help you out at Home Depot? You see, for the past decade, I, like most of the world, have been obsessed with a show called Game of Thrones. If you don't know what Game of Thrones is or have never heard of it, welcome to your first time on the internet or out in public. Mmm. I love Game of Thrones a lot. I've done a lot of Game of Thrones videos. Candy Johnson made me into a very convincing Jon Snow. And years back, I already did a My Drunk Kitchen where I made scones. Today we're gonna be making chocolate dragon eggs. So the first step is skipping um, like steps one through 10, which is making a chocolate egg. Instead, we're just gonna get a chocolate egg. Charles Xavier, this is not your moment. I'm so sorry, every moment is your moment. Are you the mother of dragons? Hope not. I don't think she's gonna win. Let's start with the most pressing question. Who do I, Hannah, think is gonna win the Game of Thrones? Now you might be thinking, Jon Snow. Jon Snow will win the Game of Thrones. Well, here's the deal. Jon Snow as a character deserves to be rewarded and the last thing he wants is to be king of the Seven Kingdoms. That's putting the dumb in kingdom. Daenerys Targaryen, the rightful heir because she don't know she fucking her nephew. I don't know if a Targaryen should be on the Iron Throne. It seems like it hasn't been going well. Tyrion Lannister, a huge fan favorite, a decent human being, a beloved character, a beloved everything. Is he gonna rule on? You're the Tyrion Lannister of my heart. Chowers, are you Tyrion Lannister? Are you the little lion? So, do I think Tyrion is gonna win? I just, I don't think so. I don't think he will, I really don't. I don't think he will. Does he deserve it? Absolutely. Will he? He probably not gonna win. So here you have John, who wouldn't want it. Daenerys, who kind of scares me now. And Tyrion, who I love, but he's the guy behind the guy. So I'm about to rock your freaking world by telling you who I think is gonna win the Game of Thrones. At the end of this video, watch time! So many spins. I've got my two little eggs. Now it's time to stick them in the freezer while we roll out our fondant. Bye bye Next, we're gonna be doing ugh, the fondant. It is a terrible but necessary aspect of this recipe, much like the deaths of your beloved characters. You guys remember that story? This is the smallest rolling pin in the entire world. What is this? This is a prop? Huh. It's just not big enough. Why roll when you can just stretch? Next step is to make another drink. Why? Well, that's a good question. It's important to question yourself sometimes. It's important to check in and make sure that what you're doing is aligned with you. So ask yourself, hey, do I want another drink? Oh no, there's alcohol in the fondant. And now it's time to move your eggs to the side while you get ice for your cocktail. Bet you didn't see that one coming. Just like I didn't see all of season five coming. Whoa, that is way too much, ew. Now we're gonna wrap our eggs in fondant. So, mm, wow. It's working! It's working! Oh my god! It worked! Look! We have a totally awesome dragon egg from this side. You know what else? This egg is like Arya Stark, and this is like, oh no! Her hopes and dreams. A girl has no name. 
Oh shit, oh shit, I'm having an epiphany. Watch out, boom! Everything was intentional. Look, the egg has a stand. It's definitely not too much fondant. And now we're gonna make our scales that cover the egg. This is gonna be so beautiful. Don't judge the way I organize. The next step we're gonna do really fast, cause we're home. You can be anything you wanna be, when it's your show. Next, we're gonna roll out more fondant. So, you can make dragon scales. I am crafting. I am a very good mom. Not yet. Not yet. Okay, how's everybody doing, party people? Now we're gonna take our little eggs on our little stands and place our scales on top. Nothing is sticking, um, but it says give them water to make it stick. So, um... Yeah. Yeah, makes a lot of sense. Was really worth doing. Yeah. I don't think anyone can question that move. Okay, wow! So we have our awesome scaly dragon egg. The reason why it's like this is because it's turning to stone. And the reason why this one's like this is because... Mm, don't ask questions. We're gonna use the other egg to support the front egg, much like you feel responsible for those in your family that came before you. Next, we're gonna do the fun part. Food color spray. Whoa. Whoa, does this look cool? Oh my God, it's turning, it's working. It's working. Holy shit. Oh my God. I'm not ready. A success. Next, we're gonna do a layer of red and then a layer of gold. Why? Well, watch and see. Oh my God, I'm an artist. Guys, I'm so proud of this. We're gonna have to have a really cool montage. That's just gonna be the way it is. I'm doing it for the gram. Wow, I'm so happy we did it. There it is, we made a fucking dragon egg. How cool is that? Ugh, but sadly, Game of Thrones is coming to an end. And so is this video, bye. Oh, sorry, Sansa, Sansa wins. That's what I think. I think Sansa wins at Game of Thrones. To do boo boo. Thanks so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, well, congratulations. You have great taste. If you want to see more, click subscribe. If you don't want to see more, that's fine. That's like probably the majority choice. So you got it. Mwah. Have a great day.